Hello everyone and welcome back. I'm going to do a slightly larger than I do to be read for September. At the time of recording I have one and a half books left on stage one of this year's self-published fantasy blog off and since stage two doesn't technically start until the 1st of November I'm gonna have a little bit of reading time for me rather than focusing on getting those books sorted out so I would like to go back to a couple of the challenges I have set myself and I've got to admit I'm accepting that I'm not going to get everything done that I thought I would but all of those challenges were set before I was chosen as a judge. The reddit fantasy bingo is not going to happen I'm not going to get to the Hugo Awards for best novel either and I fully accept that I would like to make some more headway with my reread challenge and my oldest books off my to be read challenge that I usually set myself every year. So for the reread challenge I would like to get to the Bill Hodges trilogy by Stephen King. I read these initially as they came out, I have already reviewed them all and I would just like to read them straight through. Um, Mr Mercedes is the first one and in this one we have Bill Hodges who is a retired detective and he's haunted by the cases that he could not finish, the murderers he could not find, including one who drove a stolen Mercedes into a crowd at a job fair early one morning killing eight. Uh, this one was kind of the first-ish of Stephen King's straight-up crime novels and there's pretty much what I remember there's no paranormal stuff in this at all but by the end of the trilogy that there, there definitely is he could not resist there's some great characters in this trilogy and we meet some of them again and I just want to go back and read straight through because I hadn't realized Mr Mercedes was published in 2014 which feels forever ago so this trilogy begins with Mr Mercedes then we have finders keepers and we conclude with end of watch Honestly, I don't think they're going to take me long to get through because Stephen King never really does. I did not get to Catalyst Gate in August and I really would like to get this trilogy finished because it is so, so much fun. There's so much going on. Um, this is the third book of The Protectorate by Megan E. O'Keefe and the first book is Velocity Weapon. It's over there and I absolutely loved it. In the first book Sander wakes up after an interplanetary war, her ship has been hit and she's expecting to be picked up by combat medics. Instead she's alone on an enemy ship 230 years in the future and everyone in the system is dead. Um, there's a lot of intrigue and lies and politics and all sorts and it's such a good trilogy and I love me a sentient spaceship which is one of the characters in here absolutely fantastic and I just want to see how this trilogy ends. The last book that I would like to get to is one of my oldest books on my to be read pile and this is 40,000 in Gehenna by CJ Cherry. 40,000 colonists are ignored for political reasons and over 200 years they kind of evolve. I do have to admit I have tried some CJ Cherry in the past and I wasn't a huge fan but I have this one which is more science fiction um the other one I read was kind of a science fiction -y fantasy so I'm going to give this one a go and this has been sat on my pile to read for a little while now of course there are some other books I would like to get to in September but I've been through this before if I let set myself a strict reading list for the month I just won't do it but those are five books that I would like to get to what plans have you got for reading in September I would love to know thanks for watching and I shall see you soon and please no screaming that how can it be September already it's terrifying anyway I'm going bye